Hello and welcome. I'm that guy with Tripod, and this is my review of Transformers H. I mean, the Last Night Premium Class Void Voyager Edition Grimlock. Now, uh, now, now, uh, now, now, uh, Grimlock, uh, Grimlock has always has always been been my favorite Dinobot. Um, I mean, I mean, who, who, who is? Who isn't he? Who who isn't? I mean, who doesn't like the, the fearless uh, Dinobot leader? Yeah, and yeah, yeah, and uh, and wait, and with the so um uh, when I uh, got when I found out that an uh, Age of, Ex of Extinction was gonna have him, I uh, was gonna have him and the Dinobots in it. I need to need to say I was kind of excited. I'm um, uh, but but they didn't but they didn't really uh, play play a play a big role in the movie until the very end. Uh, although Opt Optimus uh, Optimus riding Grimlock is just awesome. You have to admit that. Yeah. Anyway, and this and this guy is actually a repaint, uh, as with the the premiere edition of the of the Age of of the Age of Extinction Voyager class Grimlock. Now I didn't. Now I didn't pick that guy up, because once again the paint job. Um, that guy. That guy was orange. Um, uh, right here, uh, right here, here, and a little bit here, and maybe here. And I and I, and I didn't and I didn't and I didn't really think um, uh, that was a good um, uh, good uh, a good paint job for 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 the movie. Um, uh, uh, it wasn't really all that sh screen accurate. As with as with all uh, all of the Dinobots, so those are those, uh, um, as I as I said with um, uh, the this guy in his video, uh, anyway, yeah, yeah, but uh, yeah, the, the but the, but this premiere edition is doing wonders for for the, for the Dinobot leader. Um, um uh, there are, there are, there are no parts sticking out on him, which is good. He he is very screen accurate. Um, the orange was was replaced with the gray here, 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 and that ju and, and that just blends so much better with the with the with the with the overalls with the silver in in the design, which which is very nice. Now, um, uh, now I'll admit I'm no I'm no uh, dino expert, but uh, but I don't think that. The T Rex had this hump, or or these horns. Yeah, and I know they didn't really explain this in the movie. I'm uh, how the Dinobots got to be Dinobots, but in the video game, uh, Transformers: Fall of Cybertron, my my personal favorite, uh, my second favorite. Hang on, my my second favorite um Transformers game. It was revealed that Shockwave did some experiments on them, uh, um, uh, with, with, with um, with um, with some studies, uh, with um, with some studies he found um, uh, on prehistoric Earth. And yeah, uh, and he thought that that would be a, a great idea to try. And what do you, and what do you, and what do you expect? Um, uh, a bunch of test test subjects just came knocking knocking on his front door. Granted the granted the. Granted, the, the the they would become uh, so some of the most uh, powerful uh, Autobots ever. I mean, the most powerful Autobot team ever. But hey, you win some, you lose some. So shockwave. Anyway, yeah, yeah. But back to the sculpting on this guy. I he is very very menacing. Like um yeah, uh, and those and those horns are pretty not and those horns are really add to it. And and like um a slash over there. Uh, and I, I'm not sure if this is focusing on camera or not, but he does have red eyes, which is just a nice touch. Yeah, I'm uh, moving on to articulation. Uh, um, oh, hang on, um, hang on. Before we move on to articulation, um, the, the this whole thing is it, just a tail. It's just, hang on, it's just his weapon on his tail, which which is a nice storage. It does fit there snugly. Although one thing I don't really understand about it is that it comes. It comes apart uh, at the end, and the instructions don't really mention this. Maybe just something, something, maybe just maybe just something to 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 avoid it being broken. I don't know. Anyway, 
moving that aside, we'll save that for a mode. And yeah, okay, moving on to the articulation on this guy. Um, uh, we'll start from the head and work our way down. Um, horns are on a very tight swivel like that. So you can make him into a scared puppy. Ooh. <laughs> anyway, uh, move those back up. He does have a he does have a gimmick in him where you press this, where you press this thing, and his jaw closes. Eh, cute, but uh, anyway, as. T-Rex arms are, are on a ball joint, although, although there, won't, there, there, won't, there won't be any use for them, although, although personally, I, 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 and the plates that they're connected on can move down, and I personally um, prefer this look, I, I don't know, it, 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 sort, of, it sort of makes the, 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 the dino mode more um, T-Rexy, if that's a term. Okay, uh, moving on. Uh, legs slash arms are are on a ball joint and a swivel right 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 here yeah um, knee bend and no an no ankles in the dino feet although oh and be although because of the transformation you can go go this way but that just looks uh, broken and finally I'm uh, at the tail is right here. That's it. And yeah, uh, for a quick size, for for a quick size comparison, here he is next to uh, Dinobot Slash, which uh, which is almost as nearly as tall as him. I don't know. I don't know what what species of dinosaur this guy is, but I don't think he, he should be as big as a T Rex. And um. Uh, and because I, I don't have any other Gr Grimlock to compare this guy, any other Grimlock to compare this, compare this guy with, here is Transformers Animated Voyager Class Grimlock. Yeah. Quite a unique bunch, if I may ask. When, when, and, uh, hey, let me just move that guy aside, and here we go. Get these two in frame. Uh, I'm not sure it's really fair to compare a live action Grimlock to an animated Grimlock. Um, I, uh, I'm just I'm just doing this to for a size comparison. Oh, and um, very very interesting interesting thing. This Grimlock also has a Grimlock right here. Um, uh, yeah. Hang on, let me just get my. Um, well, while this gray Grimlock Grimlock's mouth closes, this guy's mouth mouth opens. So yeah. <laughs> anyway, I'm moving him aside. Now, now, now let's get this guy into robot mode. Okay, um, okay, we're gonna start at the back. You flip, uh, you flip the feet here up, you flip the tail up, and um, untab this entire section, which will become these his legs. I'm uh, get these things out of the way. I also, I, I, I also really, really like, uh, really like, um, uh, 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 and, uh, and how they have uh, uh, found a way to to to, con to conceal the arms a bit. Yeah, they become they become waist guards. Okay, next you bend this entire guy up, which is so his head, so his dino head will point through the ground. You move these arms apart. Uh, I like to do save the hands for last. Okay, uh, you you untab this piece. Now, now here's something where I screwed up on my figure. Um, uh, I, I was trying to pull, to pull the, the the dino's head apart from here, when in actuality it pegs in. Then it comes apart very easily, because of this. Um, uh, I, I I actually damaged my I actually damaged my figure right here. There's supposed to be uh, another peg right here, but but uh, um, uh, the. This piece actually um, came off be, be, be before I, I got the review started. Yeah, I mean it, it, it holds it holds in um very it holds in um very snugly, but 
but it th th throws off the symmetry. I might, I, I, I have to tell you. Yeah. Okay. Anyway, moving nit pick aside. Um, uh, the two halves of the dino, dino head, I'm uh, fold in here. And you collapse this, and you do this thing wherever. You split the legs. Then finally the arms, um, which are, oh, make sure this taps in the chest. You're going to have to really work it in there. Hang on, let me zoom out. Okay, I can't zoom out. Okay, um, uh, the feet, uh, the feet are, are, my, are actually my favorite. Favorite, um, uh, okay. Because uh, because they're so simple. Okay, first you fold the fold in the heel spur, then you twist the whole whole thing around, and, and you plug it into into the same hole that these spikes were were plugged in before. You should plug in right in there, and you twist the arm around like that. Not a very snug tab, but hey. And you do the same thing on this side. And there we have Grimlock in his robot mode. Let me just adjust the camera. What I hear? All right, I'm adjusting. Okay. Okay, and there we have Grimlock in his robot mode. Uh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Uh, sorry. Uh, I'm sorry uh, if you can't um, see him all that well. Um. Uh, the chandelier that that, that, current, that that currently lights this room, um, uh, for three of its five bulbs are burnt out, and we have yet to to to, to fully replace them. Yeah, my bad. Anyway, um, uh, overall, really nice, um, uh, Grimlock. Um, uh, one of the main um, uh, come one of the main um, problems with Grimlock is that um, uh, here, here, uh, here, uh, 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 uh the, the the problem persists in this guy, so so, so so let me quickly transform him. Okay. Reviewing at its best. Oh, we're crying out loud. There we go. Working on the arms. And there we go. These two are such a contrast to one to one another. Anyway, anyway, yeah, as you can see what see what I'm, uh, the, the the main problem is the back kibble. Yeah. Luckily, the, luckily the, this guy has big feet, so not a problem for him. But yeah, with most Grimlocks, it's usually it's usually um uh, this backpack with that Dinobot head uh, and these and these um uh, two panels I've seen. I mean, yeah, the other figures, including the, including the G1. Yeah, but but with this guy, he he splits his, his Dinobot his his Dino his Dino head and makes some awesome new looking shoulder panels. Though the, the, the those red eyes are 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 just plain menacing, and this guy just looks intimidating. I I, I especially love them uh, his his bulky forearms, which are the, which are the, the the Dinobot feet. They're they're just amazing. Yeah. Uh yeah and okay uh, let me just move that guy aside. Um uh, now let's move on to to. To the assessor, uh, assess, uh, accessory. Now, instead, instead of the sword, I'm um, uh, they gave uh, gave him this mace, which is okay, but but I match much re much re would require a sword. Sword. Anyway. Anyway, um, uh, he, it it plugs into his arm right here, but I kind of wish instead of that, I'm um, uh, uh handle handle that, that sort of comes off of the main shaft um, his his is actually connected to his actually grab hold of the shaft 
inserts as a sexual innuendo here. And wait, like, um, oh, he does, to, he, he does not want to let it go, uh, I'll give him that. And wait, um, uh, I kind of wish um, uh, that, that when you, um, uh, remove, when you unclip this, you can slide it in his hand and put it back in there. In there. In there. Which would, which would just, which would just look a bit much cooler, if you ask me. Uh, the, this thing can also store in his robot mode. Ah, uh, the instructions don't really to tell you where. Um, I think, I think that they assume that hole right there. But uh, but this um, handle isn't isn't long enough to to reach it. But you can um, uh, unfold this part and place it right in here. Here, it does it doesn't connect in, in, into anything. But it uh, but it uh, but it is uh, nice to look at. Yeah. Okay. Um. Uh, yeah. Okay. Um. A few more, um, uh, okay, a few more, um, uh, a few more, uh, 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 uh okay, and, uh, and, uh, another thing I really, I really like about, um, uh, the current, uh, Dinobot design is that, uh, they all, they all look, um, uh, like they, um, uh, like, a, uh, like a mid, mid, medieval knight. Yeah. Which is why they are pointy, um, which is why they have pointy feet, uh, pointy toes right here. Um, uh, 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 uh recently uh, I've been having cool, quite, quite the fascination with, with, uh, with, 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 with midi, with midi, mid, black, medieval knights and all that, which uh, makes me really kind of wish uh, that this was a sword. Sword? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, 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 that, so that's why I, that's why I'm kind of, I'm kind of excited for for the for the age of ex of extinction. I mean the Transformers the last night movie. Yeah, it's, seriously, I'm a Transformers. I'm a five fighting with 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 King Arthur. Pretty much rewrites itself. Fat Fact writers, you know what to do. Anyway, I'm a now for our articulation robot mode. I'm a. The arms, the arms are kind of uh, the same, since they do form the Dinobot legs. Though, 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 um, I, though, you you have to twist the twist the arms, which is really tight, um, right here. Yeah. yeah in order to to get him to raise his fist. Yeah. <laughs> what? Uh. Hey, he can move back and forth. Um. Uh, a uh, ball, a ball joint at at the hip. Although, although, the, although these panels do may may get in the way. So, 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 um, arm with caution. They can go out that far. Oh, bend at the elbow. Pretty good. Uh, only, uh, only nine, only ninety degrees. Sadly. Um. The 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 head uh, by uh, the. Uh, hang on. Well. Again, these can swivel. Uh, ninety, a uh, ninety degree knee, and um, probably something, probably something I'm uh, unheard of uh, for for Voyager, Voyager classes, but uh, ankle, ankle, uh, ankle, ankle pivot. Although that's not really much of a much of an ankle pivot, more like breaking, breaking, breaking his leg. Yeah, but. Uh, uh, and it doesn't really look all that natural, f natural for from before. Natural, um, natural, um, all the way out. But if you fiddle with it enough, you. But if you um, pose it quick, quickly, quickly, um, uh, pose them right, uh, it it does look completely natural. And yeah. No, did I forget anything else? No. Okay, I'm uh. And with that, that's all I pretty much have to say about this guy. Oh, and one more thing. Oh, wait. Wait, one more thing. I'm, uh... Uh, uh He, he can't really hold his mace, um, uh... Mace, um, uh... Thre 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 
threatening me. Uh, he can't really um, turn his mace um, uh, while this thing is plugged into his forearm. So in order to do that, you have to twist, twist the elbow right here. Right here, and uh, this too. Hang on, wait. Twist it 90 degrees. Mm. Yeah, this guy is kind of um, awkward to pose. Okay, there we go. Move it here. So yeah, like that. Oh, who am I getting? Hmm. Okay, then I... Okay, I'm going to remove this. Anyway. Anyway. Yeah. Yeah, the, yeah that's why I want to play about this guy. I'm a, he, he's, he's sort of um, uh, awkward to handle. And I'm... Uh, I'm, one, I'm one thing about the bicep swivel. I'm a... Uh, it, it, it honestly feels like... Like, because this is so tight, I'm, pu I'm putting pressure on that little peg. On this... On this thing. See it? Yeah, it takes a while for it to turn, which is which is kind of scary. That's why uh, that's why uh, I always hold it at, at the shoulder. Yeah. Oh. Okay then. Uh, this. Get it? Okay. Yeah. Anyway. Well, yeah, um, uh, with that being said, I'm overall a great figure. Do I recommend him? E Yes, it, yes, am I? If you're a Grimlock fan, absolutely. If you're a T-Rex fan, I'm uh, I'm not entirely sure his alt mode is a T-Rex, so uh, yeah, yeah. So yeah, pick this guy up if you if you're a Grimlock fan or 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 I'm um, uh, whatever. Anyway, I'm that guy with Tripod signing out until the next video. Peace.